Today, I'm going to react to rappers' watch collections. This is what you call the big dog. This AP right here is valued over a million dollars. I had to get this from a dude who had to go to auction for this in Beijing because I really wanted it. This is a baguette AP from AP. So like a lot of people can't say they got this watch right here. Good man. Audemars PK Royal Oak Factory set. Very, very nice. I'm impressed. It's not something I would personally wear, obviously. I'm a very not rapper style type of uh, boomer. So I can't really flex that sh but it's good to see it is a factory set out of Mar PK. He says it's a million US dollars. It's hard to really value that watch because this could be a potential piece unique. And that means that it's only worth as much as someone is willing to pay for it. This is a sky dweller. This is the big boy rolling. I'm passing this immediately because this is unacceptable. This is a Rolex sky dweller that you literally fucked in the ass. It's a very special watch. I have talked about that watch in previous videos. It is the most complicated watch Rolex has ever produced, period. You don't f with that. This is the big boy Rolex. Not only is it bust down, but you got to really look in the middle of the bust down and realize there's like 40 pointers in each of these. I don't even really have too much to say about it. I think it's one of those things you should look up and understand the value of the watch by itself without the diamonds. So the value of this watch without the diamonds would be in and around 35,000 pounds. This watch with the diamonds is worth all. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and realize that it's just- He's actually missing a diamond. Look, he's missing a diamond. That's how incredibly this watch is set. He's missing a diamond on the side of the case. Realize that it's just it's a big boy watch. It's a playboy watch. I don't really like to gloat about it, but I'm very happy about this watch. All right. I'm very sorry that I just um, completely and utterly destroyed your watch. And I'm happy that you're happy. And it makes me happy that you're happy. That's all that matters. This is my baby. All of this stuff right here, all of that is gonna turn green in the dark. I ain't even know that to like, I was in the dark with it one day and I was just looking, I said, oh, and it was just lit up. This is one of my favorite pieces. This was another gift from my deuce. I got another story behind this one. It's actually a crack on my face. Look at, look at his teeth. Aftermarket teeth, not even the original teeth. I wish I had the balls to do that. I know a lot of you guys don't even realize that you haven't subscribed yet. So, subscribe, please. Thank you! I got this from Shine Jewel. This is like 80. Scott Dweller, two-tone Rolex. Who are you kidding? That's not 80,000 US dollars. That's a two-tone. Golden Steel Sky Dweller, $15,000. You threw a few diamonds on. It's probably worth it. $10,000, fuck off. Got this AP right here, bust down. She come from shine too. It's bust down on the belt, all around the side. This AP should have been the original, fucking unbelievable, and he just absolutely destroyed it like every other rapper previously. Sometimes I wear both these watches at the same time, just on some stunning like, whatever. He wears both at the same time. Why would you wear both of your watches at the same time? Why, like, why? So this is the same type of thing of, you know what, I'm going to work, but I'm going in my car with my motorbike on the roof so everyone can see that I have a motorbike and a car. Guys, come on, we need to talk. I don't like to give you all the time. I don't like that. It's all about positivity, spreading love in this world. Rappers with your funny names. This is money down the drain and bullshit. Sky Dweller. I just got this one like on my birthday. This one's fire. This is a two-tone Royal Oak Audemars. Is it actually discontinued? Who'd you get this one from? Oh, Icebox. You got it from Icebox. Just an honest question here, right? And I'm, it's, I'm not trying to be a snob. Maybe I am, but it doesn't matter. All these guys have all the dough in the world, right? They're fucking rich. Why the hell do they not buy factory set watches? Why? What is the whole fucking thing? What is going on? Just don't do it. Like Gucci Mane has the proper baguette set. An unbelievable, insane watch that says, look at me, I can look at myself, it mirrors myself, I don't f know what I'm saying. Sometimes I'll start a sentence and I don't even know where it's going. I just hope I find it along the way. Just say factory set, go to Rolex, say who you are, say that you're the big boy and they will allow you to buy something and special with diamonds or specially for you or whatever the f but stop doing this. Sh Little pump, just do other stuff than watches, please. Um, eat your chicken nuggets or whatever the f that is. Rolex Datejust. Um, this watch was actually gifted to me 
Like, the first one it was given to me, like, no diamonds. Well, actually, this watch was more, like, sentimental, you know what I'm saying? So instead of just buying a new watch and keeping this one, I just, like, added on to this watch. Lovely story, and I understand it has a lot of sentimental value, but what do you want me to say? F***ing ridiculous and f***ing horrible. It's unacceptable that you, again, destroyed this beautiful, sentimental watch. But listen, it's your watch. I hope you're happy with it. And I actually paid more for this watch than you would regularly pay for one because I, I, I built the watch, like, from scratch. You built the watch from scratch. So you built the watch? From scratch. Right, so let me visualize this. Um, do you source all the metal and you just, like, you you go into the mines and get in gold, and then you're like, oh, there's from scratch. This watch, it's an AP watch. New, new set in AP, the honeycomb set. I think I paid like maybe 55,000, 60,000 for this watch a minute ago. This guy literally has been penetrated from behind without being kissed first. If he paid 60 grand for that, he has been definitely taken from the backside before he's actually being kissed. You need to woo someone first. You didn't pay 60 Gs for that. I wear watches for more of a fashion. I wear two watches a lot, and I neither one of them never had the correct time. I am fucking sick of this. You guys are fired. Why the fuck is it all the fucking same shit? Can't you just put someone normal? It's just like normal watch. I want, I want positivity. I want fun, incredible watches. Not this piece of and shit, you fucking bastard. You fired? Go. See ya. If I was a rapper, I would call myself Big Gandalf.